Like, there's just so many unanswered questions. I was useless. I gotta go shopping. I hate shopping. And it shows off, like, <laughs> my belly and my hips. Your girl is not fashionable. Hey, I'm Zita, and I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different today, and I'm gonna be figuring out how to dress for the female gaze. G-A-Z-E, not G-A-Y-S. Don't get too excited. So currently from my scrolling on TikTok, what I understand about the female gaze is that it's basically dressing for you and not for the attention of men. So I think I would describe my style as like kind of comfortable and chill, but also kind of like vintage -y vibes, I guess. I'm very much about dressing for comfort, but I think, I don't think I look uncool when I dress. The clothes that I wear like are a lot more masculine than feminine. So with the female gaze, from what I currently understand it, I think I kind of hit the comfortable side, but maybe not the aesthetic side. I like my boobs. I like showing them. Is that leaning into the male gaze? But because I like showing them, then is it the female gaze? Like there's just so many unanswered questions. So I'm doing this video because I want to push the boundaries of what I wear normally. Like I think I play it pretty safe. Also because I want to understand what the female gaze is. We gotta go shopping. We gotta go shopping. I hate shopping. I hate shopping. So this inspo photo is an example of something that I Really love, not something I would probably wear, but definitely something more like up my alley. I feel like I kind of have to pick between dressing like more femme or more mask. Like I don't feel like I can live in a world where I want to wear both kinds of clothing or I can wear both kinds of clothing, which is so stupid because I feel like you don't need to put yourself in a box. You can wear whatever you want and you can wear anything as long as you feel comfortable and like, you know, confident and hot. I'm really nervous because first of all, I hate shopping. Second of all, I don't really know what I'm buying. I love the oh, shops. This way? No, that's You're leaning towards me. I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna survive getting all three pits. <laughs> I'm gonna really struggle with this one. I should not have signed up for this. <laughs> really testing the willpower. Shopping sucks, dude. What about shopping for femme stuff? Shopping for femme stuff? Even worse, because I don't know what to buy. From Who's got shops? back from the shops? How was that experience? It was exhausting, it was tough. It was tiring, how about you? How did you feel? I'm tired, I'm exhausted. I forget how much I hate shopping. Yeah. Also shopping for something that I'm not comfortable with is really, really hard. I was useless, I thought I could help on the camera, but in terms of fashion stuff, that stuff I'm not good at, so. I should have brought Sohan. I should have brought Sohan. This is the first outfit and I will and truly feel like a farmer wench. Why? Churning the butter. This is so far from anything I would wear, it's actually hilarious. Puff and, th and frills, it's just not, not my jam. And it shows off like <laughs> my belly and my hips. <laughs> and oh, I don't love this one at all. This is the style of outfit that I think people think the female gaze is. You know, it's like, oh, cottage core, like farmer wench, like frilly puffy, like flowy linen vibes. It still is like tight and showing, you know, my body and like kind of, you know, sexualized, which I feel like is everything the female gaze isn't. And also I don't feel comfortable in this at all. I don't like it. I'm realizing that the female gaze is like an aesthetic, not so much a style or a trend. Like it doesn't come down to just one piece of clothing. It's more of like a, wear what makes you feel good. And I found this TikTok that like explains it really, really well. Let's talk about the female gaze. So we know about the male gaze, right? Where the male gaze looks while the female body is looked at. This creates a binary where male means active, whereas female means passive. Thus it commercializes and it commodifies the female body. One of the ways in which I like to describe the female gaze is that it seeks to empathize rather than objectify. It is a way for women to reclaim ownership over their body and it is more emotional and intimate. An example of this is Woman Her Toilette by Morisot. This painting, we're seeing a woman in the intimacy of her room taking down her hair. That's it, nothing else. Even though we can see her shoulder on her back, which for the time was quote unquote scandalous. The woman is not sexualized in any way. Like I feel like this is more female gaze because it's 
like comfortable but still stylish and something that I don't know I would want to wear which is what I'm starting to figure out is the female gaze it can be anything as long as you're comfortable so this is probably way more up my alley kind of like loose like shirt and like biker shorts I feel like you could definitely wear sneakers with this outfit which is much more my vibe I look good I could still wear sneakers I'm much more comfortable than the first outfit I'm also like the worst person to do one of these videos like your girl is not fashionable out of all three outfits this is definitely the one that I would wear the most but it's still like not really my style but I think this is definitely the most like female gaze but still out of my comfort zone and I don't hate the leather pants, but I reckon with this you could like, I tried it with my Doc Martens and I also tried it with like a different pair of shoes. And I feel like either kind of go, but again, it's not jeans and a t-shirt. So I'm like, lol. <laughs> Third time lucky and I think we finally kind of got there. So over the course of these three outfits and trying to figure out what the female gaze is, I have learnt that I hate shopping and putting outfits together. So if I could have a personal stylist slash shopper, that'd be amazing. So I feel like the moral of the story is wear whatever the fuck you want and be confident in it. And that's the female gaze. If you have a different opinion as to what the female gaze is, please comment below um, and let me know because I could be completely wrong. But that's how I'm going to interpret it. The female gaze is so much more than just a style. Dress for yourself. Don't dress for men. Don't dress for other women. Dress for you. And wear clothes that make you feel good.